there's a responsibility to to move my experience from novelty to normalcy to enable others to see themselves in the roles that I'm playing or the positions that I hold and to make it more possible for people who are like me or people who are not like me, but who have been historically left out to see a path in that is viable and that is accessible and that's real and empowered. And I think that is part of my responsibility. So part of the way that I um, hope to carry myself in, in this position as I've held it for these last few years and hopefully going forward is in a way that lets people know that this type of role belongs to all of the people of Michigan and is available to all the people of Michigan. And it should be. And that, and that, and that if, if this is something that you choose to want to pursue or to support, that this is not, there, there will not be a door slammed in your face because of who you are, because of where you're from, because of what you look like or how you sound or who you love. And so I, I, I'm very mindful of that responsibility. And it's part of why I try to be very transparent with my experiences in terms of bringing my whole self and the entirety of my life experience to my service, but then also showing people just like what it's like to be in this job. I do a lot of, you know, <laughs> videos and stuff. Hey, this is what I'm doing today. This is what I'm going. This is what I'm thinking. Um, I try to post a lot of pictures about the different things that I'm doing and experiencing and learning because I want people to understand that I, I think it matters who is in this position serving alongside the governor of Michigan. And I think it matters um, that that person be reflective of the entirety of the ex Michigan experience to the extent that they can. And that I believe will help make accessible or will help open the imaginations of people in Michigan to recognize that you know, this is the type of role they can play too.